always a rainbow within reach on animal Good to see you. Let's see what everyone's doing. Everyone's painting. Look, they've already painted four paintings. One, two, three, four. Four paintings. Let's count together. One, two. Three, four. Four paintings. Four is a number. Say four. Four. That's exactly right. Let's make four our number of the day. Let's do the monkey dance. Yay! Yeah! Yeah! There's a brand new dance you need to count To do each move the right amount There's a special number, the number four Come on and count with me Get ready to do everything four times Clap four times Nod four times Four times! I knew I could count on you! You do the monkey dance, the monkey dance. Come on, everybody, do the monkey dance. You do the monkey dance, the monkey dance. Come on and dance with me! Let's count together! Four! There are four apples. One, two, three, four. Now count them with me. One, One two, two, three, four. How many apples in all? Four. Yeah. Come on, Wigglebugs, snack time. <laughs> Let's count together. Four. There are four wiggle bugs. One, two, three, four. How many wiggle bugs in all? Four. 
That's right. Let's take their pictures. Say cheese! <laughs> Thank you for helping me take that picture. It's story time. Yay! Gather round, everyone. What book are we reading? We're reading this one. It's called Achu. How loud is an elephant's sneeze? Let's read and find out. Let's begin. Achu. Written by Deepa Balsavar, illustrated by Nancy Raj. Achu! went Monkey. She had a terrible cold. That was loud. I almost fell off the tree, said Cuckoo, poking his head through the leaves. Really? asked Monkey. If this is loud, how loud do you think an elephant sneeze would be? I can only guess, said Cuckoo. Maybe as loud as this. Ah-choo! That's not loud enough, said Porcupine. An elephant sneeze is much louder than that. Ah-choo! He blew out his little cheeks and his pointy nose quivered. Grunt, grunt, said Wild Boar. That's not loud enough. An elephant sneeze must be huge! And taking a deep breath, she went, uh, achoo! Grunt, grunt. What's all this noise? asked Deer. Do you know how loud an elephant sneeze is? asked Monkey. I always sneeze politely, said Deer with a sniff. But an elephant must have a huge, disgusting sneeze like this. Ah, ah, chew! Ah, 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 chew! Excuse me. Ah, chew! All the animals jumped, while Buffalo joined the group. That's an elephant sneeze, he said proudly. Deer, wild boar, porcupine, cuckoo, and monkey looked at him with admiration. Not bad, but not quite, purred a low voice. Wild Buffalo's nose quivered. Tiger leaped out from behind the bushes. She threw her head back, opened her mouth wide, and gave the loudest sneeze you could ever imagine. She went, ah, ah, Elephant walked into the clearing. Pardon me, he said to Tiger. Do you have a cold too? I have one, and I am going to sneeze. What? roared Tiger. What? bellowed Wild Buffalo. What? barked Deer. What? grunted Wild Boar. What? squealed Porcupine. What? sang Cuckoo. Oh, wow, thought Monkey. Uh, well, uh, went Elephant. The whole forest waited. Here it comes, thought Monkey. <laughs> ah, that felt good, said Elephant. Nothing like a good sneeze to clear out the trunk. Then he looked around and wondered, Where have all the others gone? Cuckoo began to laugh. Now do you know how big an elephant's sneeze is, he asked Monkey. Yes, said Monkey, but... Not another question, wailed Cuckoo and flew hurriedly away. The End Thank you, Mr. Goose. Thank you for reading with me. 
Kids, it's time for a sing-along with Mr. Frog. Yay! Remember to say hello when you see him. Hello, kids. Hello, Mr. Frog. I'm going to teach you a song called Five Little Speckled Frogs. Frogs? Oh, like you, Mr. Frog. That's right. Today, you can all pretend to be frogs. Yay! <laughs> I'll sing the first part, and then you sing along with me. How many frogs did I say there were? Five! Good listening. Here we go. Five little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are four green speckled frogs. Now I want you to all sing along with me. I want to hear you sing too. How many frogs are there now? Four! Four little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum! One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are three green speckled frogs. How many? Three! Three little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum! One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are two green speckled frogs. How many? Two! Speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum! One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there is one green speckled frog. How many? One! One little speckled frog sat on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum! He jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are no green speckled frogs. Well done. Yay! Thank you for singing with me. And thank you, too. Thank you, Mr. Frog. Here's something we already did. Let's do it again. I'm crunching leaves. But only white leaves. I see one. Let's look for more. Let's look for one more. Do you see it? There it is. We did it. <laughs> Yay! See you. Oh, hi. It's so nice to see you. Let's listen to some quiet music together. That was very nice. Thanks for visiting. Goodbye. And now it's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Let's stop to say goodbye before we say hello. We need, we need to, to say, say goodbye. goodbye. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. goodbye. <laughs> Time to rest. Take a deep breath in.
Let it out. Good. Listen. Hush a bye, baby, on the treetop. When the wind blows, the cradle will rock. When the bow breaks, the cradle will fall. Credo